Hello, my name is Priscilla and I help to coordinate the home groups along with Judith. We currently have nine home groups at St Matthew's and there are groups for all types of people, ages and stages, so something for everyone. Of course at the moment the home groups can't meet in person um, but all the groups are supporting their members in different ways. Our home group, like many of the home groups, are studying prayer this term. We're following a course called The Prayer Course by Pete Gregg of 24-7 Prayer fame. And there are videos each week um, and prayer ideas to try out at home. Um, and some of us watch it on Zoom together. Some of us read the accompanying book. Some of us read some notes that I've produced on it. And we think about the questions to do with prayer and have a go at praying together as well. And we also share prayer requests with each other and uh, support each other by ringing up or texting or emailing. So we're now going to hear about a few of the other home groups at St Matthew's and what they're doing during, during this time of lockdown. Hi, it's Mike here from the family friendly home group at St Matt's. Uh, over the last few weeks uh, in our home group, we've started reading this book, How to Pray by Pete Gregg. Uh, it's a really simple guide for normal people, which is perfect for me. And it's just getting back to the basics of prayer and how to do it. Uh, so we're really enjoying that as a home group. We're meeting every couple of weeks uh, on Zoom to discuss what we've read in the book uh, and discuss how our prayer lives are going with each other. Uh, we've also started a prayer log on WhatsApp where we're posting prayer requests for each other. And we're actually seeing some answers to prayer as well, which is great. Uh, and in the evening, sometimes in the week, we are meeting without the kids to have some fun and just do a games and a quiz night. Hi, my name is Anna. I'm one of the Young Adults Home Group leaders. Um, as a home group, we've been meeting virtually on Zoom every week, where mostly we've been playing games, having a chat, um, and I think most importantly, doing some prayer points for each other. Um, it's been really lovely to be able to speak to each other and to see each other, um, though virtually, where we can have a laugh and play games, but also have the time to really reflect on lockdown um, and think about what either we need prayer for or what people around us need prayer for, or what we just think needs prayer. Um, so we've been able to share these with each other and um, sort of reflect on it each week and talk to each other about what's been going on. So yeah, that's been lovely. Hello, I'm Enid and Jenny Fernandez and I lead a house group that meets on a Wednesday evening in normal times. Our house group has a mixture of people who have been at work during lockdown and others who have retired but are active and others in isolation. We set up a WhatsApp group and have used it extensively over the weeks to provide a supportive network for each other. There has been a sharing of prayer and thanks prayer requests, photos of the natural world and uplifting messages, as well as try to see the funnier side of life. Hello, I'm Judith and I work alongside Priscilla as a homebrew coordinator. My group meets on a Tuesday night all through the year and we've been supporting each other by prayer texts, prayer requests, phone calls, occasionally talking through the window to people. We've been a group that's been together for a number of years and as not all of the group has modern technology, the prayer texts have been invaluable in keeping us together. Also, we've uh, sent out handouts to those on email and we're looking at um, two books on prayer called The Journey of the Heart and Too Busy Not to Pray. That was after we'd finished Nehemiah. Now everyone's welcome to join a home group at any time, even if it's just for lockdown. Just give it a try because you might find that it's so supportive. Home groups are really a place where you learn more about God and you learn about other people as well from a very loving and confidential point of view. At St Matthew's we've got groups for all ages and all stages of faith. So if you're interested, contact Priscilla and myself 
and we'll discuss it with you and suggest what might be the best group for you. The best way to do this is to go to the church website www.stmatthewswalsall.co.uk and under the section Get Involved, you'll find a heading Join a Group. We look forward to seeing you. You'll be most welcome. And we hope that you will find being in a home group a more enjoyable way to enjoy the rest of the lockdown. Thank you.